Hello everyone and welcome back to Snap Animals and we are back to see what kind of really fun photos we can get of the animals in the wilds again today. Thank you guys so 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 much for your amazing support for the first little episode of Snap Animals. I agree it is absolutely adorable. It reminds me so much of Pokemon Snap. I really want to play Pokemon Snap now. So you guys if you love Pokemon Snap if you're familiar with the old N64 game then shout out because I'm totally willing to try to get my hands on it in the future. But for now we are going to enjoy some other kinds of animals, real life animals, hanging out here in the wilds and trying to get some pictures of them. So let's collect up our little coins. Boom! Have you heard about the grassland? They say there's some crazy animals there. Huh. Oh, I think that's the, the like uh, hobo guy <laughs> who walks around and kind of just checks out what we're doing over here. Can I like zoom in somehow? Maybe? I see a bunch of random stuff people have left on the ground which is kind of cool. And then there's just like these guests coming. Here we go. So there's guests coming down. And I think there's a thing over here. I can collect money for the chimp pictures taken. Tiger, take five tiger pictures. Oh, that's so cool, I see. So the more pictures we take of certain creatures, the more, the tick tick pictures, yay. The more we can unlock these pieces. And then mastery, okay, and we can explore. And we can go to the museum. So I want to explore some more today. And then what is this? Are these missions? Goofballs are great. Animals sure love them. Oh, that's right. We're supposed to gather up some goofballs and throw goofballs at our animals. And apparently that'll make them react somehow. Oop, let me get those out of your way, sir. And let's see, what's this? On your next outing, snap a picture of a charming Dakota. So Dakota the Dick Dick, which should be out there. And hopefully we can get a picture of him. It needs to look like this, okay? And then this guy, on your next tour, tap the goofball and get to know them critters. Okay, so that's something we can work on. All right, we worked on upgrading the museum. So let's see, can I upgrade the museum again? What would it take to upgrade the museum again? Um. Let's see. Oh, that would open up the grasslands. Oh, so cool. So can I upgrade it? It would take 30, it would take like 175 coins. Do I have 175 coins? I have more than that. And then how much? Okay. Oh, here we go. So you can look at all your different resources right here. So that's clay, ice, and rocks. And I'm pretty sure I have enough. So let's go ahead. I'm going to have the museum work on being upgraded and we're going to go head off. Uh, actually, so how do I get to the wilds? Not the world button. What's this? So that's settings. Getting used to everything. Do, do, do. Um, on the distant lands of billowing winds. Upgrade the museum to level three. Wow, there's so many things. Lovebirds! I want to go get a picture of a lovebird. Oh, it's so fun. Okay, so let's go see if we can get some pictures in the jungle. Also, I guess there's different areas in each zone. I get it. So we can look at the wilds, the jungle, grassland, canyon, and oasis in the wilds. And then there's also the frost area, forest range, cave, and flows, dino, swamp, crater, river, and badlands. And then the world's edge. Oh, that's adorable. I wonder if they'd add more in the future. That would be really fun. <laughs> but let's go ahead and we're going to go on an adventure and let's use up our film. Okay, so remember we can only have a certain amount of pictures and we can only pick three pictures per trip. So we're looking for Dakota or some lovebirds. We're trying to throw a gif a goofball. Oh, oh, goofball, goofball. Hey, what do you think? Oh, that's adorable. Oh, he's so cute. No, I don't mean to take so many pictures. Siri, be cautious, be cautious. Oh my gosh. Hi, little guy. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. There's a baboon. Oh, I didn't get a picture of it. I wasn't able to move fast enough. I only have two pictures left. <laughs> I need to be more discerning with when I click. Oh my gosh. All right, there's gonna be a sleeping. Oh, what's that? What's that? There's a thing over there. There's a bunch of baboons. Okay, we already got an adorable picture of a sleeping dick dick, so we don't need another picture, even though that's really freaking cute right there. Oh my gosh. Look at the baboons. What do you guys think, huh? I, I just got the rump end of some baboons. I don't think that's gonna help me too much. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Oh, I don't wanna use my camera yet. <gasps> Would there be lovebirds up in that branch? Oh my gosh. <gasps> Look. Oh, this is, this is one of the big ones. This is one of the big ones. Oh, okay, actually. Oh, and we're at the end of the tour. Just in time. That was so cool. I think we got one of the like specialty wild photos we were supposed to find, you guys. 
Oh my goodness, so I definitely wanna look at that one. We'll see what he thinks about the baboon rumps and then an up close one of the tiger. So let's see what we got. Dun 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 dun. Ta-da, companion shot. <gasps> it's a perfect score. Whoa, oh, that's so awesome, you guys. So we got our very first perfect score. It is the companion shot with the little, the little dick dick sleeping on the elephant. The business end of some baboon. <laughs> it's the angle too. <laughs> I love how we only got like two on the angle there because it's not the most attractive one really up close So not the greatest but pretty good pretty good on the little tiger All right higher score gets you picture higher score on pictures gets you more coins so We got some more coins. We got a new picture to be displayed. Let's see what we found Meteor glass. Oh more film sweet some clay mysterious hair sample and a cute carnivorous plant. Oh, that's so fun. I wish I could take it like home and like decorate my room with the carnivorous plants. That would be adorable. I don't know many other people who think that decorating with carnivorous plants would be adorable, but I sure do. All right, so we have just managed to get the companions piece right here, which is awesome. I wonder what it means to have like this meter next to it. I'm gonna have to learn. And then call me Timmy, peekaboo, and here be tiger are the things that we need to be looking for, okay? So there's lots of special like angles that you try to get to get a specific shot filled. Um, the squatter and see you later are also included in that. Oh, is there another another thing? Neato, did the animals have fun? They seem to react to it a little bit. Charlie is in the bushes. Use the goofball to call him out to play. Oh, that's interesting. So we might have to strategically use the goofball in certain areas. Man, that is so like Pokemon Snap to see if we can attract some of the animals. So let's go ahead. We'll see what we can find. Maybe we'll do some more upgrades of like the other bridges and docks. All right, what can we find? Hello, buddy! You're right in my face. Aren't you so cool? Oh, oh, lovebirds, lovebirds! Oh my goodness, lovebirds in the branches. Oh my gosh, that's so fun. Look at him go. Hi, buddy. Oh, there's an elephant. Oh my gosh, there's a tiger too. Oh, it's the squatting elephant. It's the squatting elephant. That's what we wanted like a picture of, isn't it? All right, we're getting closer. Hi, buddy. Oh, I need a picture of you, missed. It's so hard with your mouse, just so you guys know. All right, wait for it. Wait for it. Oh my gosh, he's like right here. <laughs> okay, too close, too close. Oh my goodness. I got too excited. I'm such a shutterbug, I'm so spoiled. This really brings back memories of when my mom ran a scrapbook store and it was film based way back then. Um, well, it's like digital was just coming into being used and they were still super expensive. So it's just really surreal because I remember like having to be so careful with what pictures you took. That's way too close. I think this is gonna be the one that scores us something. And then we'll do this one. Oh, and which one next? I kind of like the little photobombing tiger. But at the same time, is this Charlie? I don't know, let's try this. Let's see what we got. Oh, it's so hard to pick between the pictures. The squatting elephant, huzzah! Yes, all right, almost perfect. If we had been a little bit closer, I wasn't sure if he was gonna jump up, so I got kind of excited. All right, oh my gosh. The lovebird, yay! Aren't you so cute? All right, and then, is this Charlie? Or just a chimp? I think it's just a picture of a chimp like running up to us. Okay, so group and special shots give you a bonus. Yay, we found the lovebird. How exciting. All right, so what do we find? The other sock, some clay, a spiky plant, and an ugly flower. Oh, so cool, I love flowers. All right, so goofballs could get the reactions of different creatures. We should have a new, yes, we've got the squatter, ta-da! And this one doesn't have the meter, so that makes me wonder if because we got a perfect shot on the companions one, if that is why it has this little mark right here. So if you guys know what that mark is for, please let me know, I'm really curious. All right, and the lovebird shot on my way. Oh, so we need to get one of him flying, that's so cute, lovebird mafia? What? I want to upgrade like to the museum to see that. Oh, there's a woman here. Gran loves chimps. I'd like to send her three chimp postcards from the jungle. Okay, so I think we've already got one chimp postcard. All right, so this will be our last go 
for now. So let's test it out, see what we've got hiding over here. So exciting. All right, any chimps? Anybody, anybody coming by? Anybody hiding in there? Nope. Anybody over here? Whoop, 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 whoop. Oh, I couldn't pinch it. I couldn't like, click it fast enough. So much harder. Hello, little guy. I see we're coming up on you. Eh. Oh my goodness, and there's an elephant in the background now. Oh my goodness, that's happening. Oh my goodness, and there's the lovebird. Okay, okay. <laughs> that's so cool. Is there somebody over there? Oh, look at him. Oh, I missed him. Oh my gosh, she's running up there. Oh my goodness, what's this? Oh. <gasps> No way! They were playing with the goofball. I missed it. Oh, I, I took a picture of a tree. <laughs> Siri. <laughs> I really need to, like, I wish I could use an iPad or something because it's so hard with the mouse. Oh my goodness, you guys. But there's a little lovebird. Look at this. I hope this one gets us, like, lots of points. All right, let's see if those get us any points because that's kind of amazing. Maybe those count as one of the chimp pictures? The rider. Ten, three, aww. So we didn't get much for the spot. Aw, that's too bad. All right, well, what about this one? The bird? Yeah, yeah, it's a postcard pic of a cute little lovebird. Not doing too bad, not doing too bad. And what about this one? Better score? Ooh, so the angle and the shot are much better here. And so this has been framed now. Sweet, so we did get one framed picture out of that. I wonder if those count for the chimps. I don't think they count for chimps. All right, so let's go ahead and see what we found. We got more clay. We got a pretty flower. We have a misshapen nest. Yes. Oh my gosh. I would love to find a triangle nest like that. I would just freak out. That would be the coolest thing ever. All right. So there we go. We have two wild picks that have been framed, which are just so exciting. Yay. So let's go look. Can we look in the museum to see them framed? So, oh, there we go. There's the writer. Da -da! So that's how we can look at those. Oh, look at that. Oh, get perfect mastery shots. And then it can increase your score, I think. So let's go look down here at this one. Yeah, look. So I guess you get like little ribbons for each time you have uh, like the perfect picture taken. So that's really exciting. Oh, I really, I just love this. There's just something so appealing about it. All right. Oh, and the little museum's ready, you guys. Dun, dun, dun. So we have opened up a whole bunch of new, new things to find. There's freestyling, there's on words. <gasps> we can see herds of elephants, are you kidding me? Family unit in the jungle. Oh, we can check that nest. Birds of a feather are one of the things we're gonna be looking for in the grasslands. So next time we come back, this is gonna be so exciting. Oh, then there's a shop, what? So yeah, next time we come back, we will definitely be working more, oh, there's a little presents everywhere, on exploring the grasslands, and that's gonna be so exciting, and we can just go around. Look at all the stuff people have left everywhere. My gosh, this is so cool. Can I get like a little a little bridge built? Can I work on that? Visitor expansion, oh, that's for upgrading the museum first. All right, what about over here? Yep, upgrading the museum to level five first. Can we upgrade the museum? Is that something we can do? We sure can. So I just spent all of our money, but we are working on upgrading the museum. And so next time we come back, we'll have some new areas to explore. Super duper exciting. And I think that's everything. Oh, 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 there's one more. Oh, there's some baboon pictures. Here there be baboon, the ball thrower. So we saw that guy. We know what he's like. We'll have to find him next time. But that is done. This is so much fun. There's like just pieces. There's empty bottles everywhere. I'm glad we're picking up after them. But this is just so fun. It's just beautiful art style. Really, really reminds me of Pokemon Snap, the way you can go back to the same area again and again. And there's different things that you can see each time and ways you can interact with the animals. So I look forward to sharing more of these little adventures with you guys. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.